What up? We out here, Portland, Oregon right now. I got T Nutty with me. It's an exclusive crackmusic.com interview. You know, the nut factor. What's up, T Nutty? Yeah, man. North, this man. great Northwest. We out here doing it one more time. How long you been rapping? Shit, nigga. I've been rapping forever, nigga. I remember rapping, going to see my pops when he was in the pen. I think I was in the fourth grade. Still another rapper's raps to try to make my pops think I was tight. You know what I'm saying? And once, he, once I seen how convinced he was and how he was telling all the other inmates when they was, oh, man, listen to my son rapping. I'm, you know, it was time for the nigga to go. I seen how... You know how much attention it got me. I said, man, I like this attention. So, shit, since then, I just started trying to create my own shit before I got caught rapping other nigga shit. When was the first time you was in the studio, and uh, who'd you go with? First time I was in the studio was at the candy shop, man, in West Sacramento. Like I said, I'll revert back to Pops. He had got out the pen this time, you know. <laughs> He was making a motherfucking, uh, uh, he was building the, the carpet and shit for the shit and doing a little building and shit for, you know, how they built the studios and shit. He was doing the shit. But yeah, my son, right, whoop, whoop, whoop. They had put me on with a, 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 a low key, the producer. Low key was locked in with Killer Tay, you know, Marvelous San Quinn, uh, all them. So shit, I think that was back when uh, I say first time in the studio, probably was like shit, seventh, eighth grade, eight that days. You know what I'm saying? So is that how you met? Is that how you met Marvelous Killer Tay and them? Uh, I met Killer Tay at the candy shop. I met uh, Marvelous, you know, uh, shit coming up, just coming up, you know, as a sack rapper. Then I bumped in more. Then Bo came home from the pen. He heard about me. You know what I'm saying? Uh, X-rated the first one who actually put me out. You know what I'm saying? He, uh, on, on a Madman compilation. You know what I'm saying? Madman record. Shouts out to Big X-rated Loco. Uh, shit, man, it's just, you know, uh, uh, shit, shit go back, man, as far as I can remember, man, I was fucking with Lil Pig, you know what I'm saying, Lil Pig, he was the first, I was in high school, so he was the first high school kid, to, uh, he was, you know, to have an album out, you know what I'm saying, so he was the star at the time, so my mission was to go chop him, you know, and come, come for his head, you know, shouts out to my nigga Lil Pig, you know, thanks for that shot you gave me. No, I'm just saying, I've just been, you know, bouncing around right. and shit. Right, So, so, your motivation, you coming out of Sacramento rapping. Yeah. Your motivation is coming, I mean, the people who you watch coming up, who was your biggest influences when you started this music thing? Shit. Snoop Dogg, Pac, Sebo, X-Rated, Lynch, uh, motherfucking, uh, shit goes on, Scarface, motherfucking, uh, Shit, Sin Mob, motherfucking, uh, motherfucking, uh, RBL Posse, motherfucking, uh, yeah, there's a lot of motherfuckers, man, you know what I'm saying? Then I heard Twister, that's when I was playing football. I heard Twister, I'm like, damn, this nigga's from another motherfucking planet rapping that motherfucking fast. Let me see if I can do that shit, man, you know what I'm saying? And I tried that shit, you know, just a little, with a little more clarity. You know what I'm saying? Well, what you know what I'm saying? And I was like, you know, that shit was fun. It was a fun way of rapping, so I, I picked that up a little bit, added it to the arsenal. How old are you? Shit, I'm 30. 30 years old. Okay. Um, how many albums you got out? Shit, I got about solo albums. I got about four albums. Four solos. I got about a uh, couple group albums, probably about three group albums. You know, and the rest is just little compilations and shit. Right. So... Somebody that wants your music, where would you tell them to go right now? Go find some T-Nutty. Downloading it, CDs, or how can they find you? iTunes. Google me. You Google the name T-Nutty Nut. You know what I'm saying? You know, everybody's buying uh, music off the motherfucking internet these days. So I just type my name up, man. And there'll be a price tag behind that shit. There's some sites you can go get that shit for free. What, what, what's the name of the new album? Uh, Blue Venom, man. That's the well, shit. You talking about this shit? Oh, is that it? Yeah, this okay. is, this is okay, the, Take out the shirt, the T-Nutty. Yeah, yeah. We want to know what we, we want to know about all of them. With all they can go get to get some tea nutty. Yeah, man. You know, just sack it up and serve it in stores now. You know what I'm saying? In your hood near you, online. You know, a lot of videos going on. Uh, uh, you know, and right now I got that blue venom in the chamber. You know, just working for my, you know, just working for the blue team right now. Trying to, you know, get up, give us some good quality music. You know what, what, I mean? what video should they go watch? That's what you got some on YouTube. They can go watch. What, what video should, should they go watch? Oh, shit, watch them all. Watch them all, man. Uh, Shit, uh, West Coast Chopper, On Your Mind, uh, shit, uh, what else I got, fuck, I, I mean, I've been doing so much work, bro, trying to catch up, man, I'll be forgetting the names of shit, I just do it, 
Sometimes I don't even name this shit. We out here. We out here on tour. You know, we on this Rat Poison tour. We kicking it off. This is the first city, Vancouver, Washington. T Nutty and Nut here. He in the building. You know, we gon' we gonna chop it up some more later on. You know, we coming at you. Crackmusic.com. Smurf Luciano. T Nutty. We wrapping it up. The fact is up, man. You know, I, go buy that album, man. Stay fucking with me. I'm gonna stay gassing that shit. You know, you know how I do. Oh. Hey, hey, after these box going, I'm not pressing these up no more. So yeah, these oh, is the last classic. Yeah, 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 this is a limited edition. Some real ass yeah. shit. Yeah. Sack it up and serve it. If you ain't got this shit, you is a square. I'm, I'm going in on this Blue Venom album, man. Real shit. So y'all stay tuned. Buckle up them boots. Tea Nutty. Tea Nutty. Grind Life Music Grow. Right, my way. from the day, from the day, from the day, from the day.